You'll on true and welcome to another exciting day in our galaxy and it's quite an exciting week so to speak and I'm not talking about the bugs that I'm still angry about at the moment because I'm affected personally with my mission but I'm talking about all the stuff they introduced and uh, the, the complicated stuff is, is working so I cannot complain about that. But despite the waves and the battle simulator and new refits, there are also new officers and uh, about one I want to talk today in this quick video and that's Enterprise E Riker. For my viewers that just started playing the game, I will do it step by step again. So if you look at the top left of your screen, you see ships, officers, command faction items and refinery. And if you click on officers, you get a list of all the officers. And I need the list because um, yesterday evening, from the point of view when I'm filming this, um, the new battle pass came out. And so Enterprise E Riker is someone I don't have yet. I have nine shards of Riker. Oh, yeah. And that's something that's happening a lot at the moment as well. Um, when I'm playing on my iPad, it's... Uh, crazy but I have to film it on the iPad is what I show you but as I always say I'm not editing this out although some people demanded that I want to give you the real game experience here and this is a part of the game experience and I'm not the only one a lot of people in my alliance experience the same maybe someone commented with the newest iPad Air on the market it might not happen to you but with a lot of different iPads this happens and so this is the real gameplay I'm not sugarcoating this and that's why I'm not editing it out when it happens but I go back to the offices and then scroll down to Riker and hope that he opens this time and then we have a look at him as you see he is still uh, just a hologram so because I don't have him Riker is from the Enterprise E crew last time on the last battle pass on make it so one we got Enterprise E Picard and Enterprise E data and now on make it so part two we have Enterprise E Riker and Enterprise E Troy and as I said today, I want to talk about Riker. He's an epic officer. We quickly look at the information button down there. He's a command class. He's from the group Enterprise E, of course, and the faction is Federation. And there are always nice uh, information text there. So if you want to read them, um, fire away. He has a captain's ability and an officer ability. I mean, he was captain of the Titan, so that fits. And uh, his captain ability is Eternity Awaits. And that means he increases your ship's base impulse speed by 50%. Might become in handy in some wave defenses. Um, I don't have him yet, so I'm not doing the combinations. But impulse speed is something that's very important on the wave defenses as well. And fear is the true enemy is his officer ability. And that means increases critical hit chance by 2% for four rounds each time you score a hit. And that once per weapon. Those percentages in green, they do increase when you level up and tear up the officer. So uh, that will change in time for you. And that's why it's just 2% now at the beginning when you first get him. But this will also help, I mean, for four rounds and each time you, you score a hit once per weapon, um, that can give you a lot of critical hit chances um, because uh, it lasts quite long. It didn't say cumulative, that's a shame, but uh, at least you get a higher critical hit rate. So um, he will definitely not be one of my most favorite officers in the end, but um, he will come in handy, especially with the impulse speed stuff. I'm quite happy about Enterprise EP card, as you might have known. Um, because I'm using him all the time. I called it uh, in the new PMC in our Alliance chat and, and someone somehow that uh, became the standard phrase for it now, new PMC. So instead of Pike, it's Picard, Moreau, Chen um, for hunting hostiles and I'm using him because uh, he's bringing me much more loot and he's strong enough. It's a very good combination this new PMC. So I'm, I'm, I'm not so unhappy with the new Enterprise E officers. And um, Data is on one of my um, survey ships all the time because of, of the cargo hold 
bonus he brings below deck. So um, th they they introduced a lot of new officers this year, and I'm, I still don't have some of those they they introduced um, because. Uh, for Riker, I need another 100 shards, and uh, depending on on the events coming, I I will see if I can manage to get him or not in the first place in the first round, but uh, I will try. With I hope uh, there with the material events I can do a little bit because I have to upgrade my ops um, and so on. So so I will try, and I hope um, there will be some some other events where I can get some, and from the battle pass, of course. The nine uh, shards I already have, I got from um, missions I've already done. I've done the missions you have to do for the for this new battle pass, the, the new standard missions um, where you can score points. And that's where I got the, the nine shards I already have. And the rest I will try with the other events. And uh, I'll see about the battle pass because in the new battle pass, and that's what I said I... In the battle pass that is now under events and not under season passes anymore because there is uh, territory territory um, season pass and now the wave defense pass so they introduced a third one at the same time but the battle pass is now with events and in the battle pass and that's what I what I said uh, before I um, usually get the elite because that's where spending money is really worth it from my point of view. I did it even before I made the videos because of all the resources and materials I got there and the officer shards and stuff and it's not that expensive. Uh, I didn't spend a lot of money, it was a very low average every month but the elite battle pass was one of the things I, I definitely did and the other often was the officer uh, pass that came later. Now, since I'm doing these videos, I'm, I'm spending a bit more. That's why I, from time to time, um, talk about that there are ways to support this channel in the video description and under the video. So if you ever think about it, have a look. But um, with this battle pass, I will get, get more um, Riker shards as well. And um, I already got two, so that was seven from missions and two from here. There will be one... And the free one again and there will be two more and uh, so on the first look there will be 19 more and as I said I hope uh, that there will be some events where I can get some um, coming up especially when there is an, a recruiting event where you have to spend materials that's the point wh what I'm waiting for to, to uh, upgrade my ops to ops 48 then and I hope that I have enough uh, uncommon ore by then, four-star ore, that I need to do that. But um, that's how to get Riker, and that's what he does. It was just supposed to be a quick video on this one. If you um, have your own thoughts about um, the Enterprise E Riker, please let me know in the comments, of course. If you have questions, video requests, and so on, you know the drill by now. <laughs> a lot of people are using it. And uh, for the new viewers uh, that see a video of mine for the first time, hi there. Um, you can do that too. And uh, if you want to see another video immediately, YouTube has chosen one for you in the end screen. That's why I don't know which one it is. But I'll see you there. I'll be back.